So today it's like steady swim, longer swim with a bit of, bit of uh, longer interval, so like yeah, 800 to 1,000 meters intervals, and then just keep it, keep going. What's yeah. that? How's actually the Kona prep going? How are you getting into it? Um, Were you in 2019? Yeah, I was, yeah. How'd you get on? Um, so this time around, I found it a bit difficult. Um, my body has not really responded as I thought it would. So, um, you know, that's something you learn from. But, you know, being here in Kona and being at World Championships, it's a bit difficult mentally to actually like accept the fact that I'm not firing on all cylinders yet. But Why do you think that is? I, to be honest, I have no clue. Uh, it could be the humidity that it's just when it's there all the time. Um, yeah, that could be. But you know, basically, I do all the same stuff as I do back home. So. Well, you've got um, a little over a week to adjust. Yeah, true. true. <laughs> Plenty of time in the tank, and that's what. So that's what you always have to remind remind yourself that it's it's not important what sessions you do leading into the race. What's important is that you're actually fresh going going into the race. So I know the fitness is there, and I just have to trust in that. And see now I've told now I've told you and I've told James and James will walk around to all the athletes and oh, Daniel's not feeling great. Yeah. <laughs> what, what said you wanna hear a secret? <laughs> what I said on YouTube says on YouTube. Yeah yeah true. They still trying to find a way to win. How the guy that's when it all began. I don't need a rolling on my wrist. Perfect time and got with the sense. I've been working since I was a kid. I just gotta keep my head up. And I'm never gonna let up. Started yoga as well. That's for the only fans. Uh, bought a 360 camera. Seriously, you should start it. It's it's good for you. It's, it's good for the love making. Since I've started yoga, I've not had one single sex partner. <laughs> So both uh, dolphin, dolphins and turtles, all of a sudden I could just hear it, um, like the dolphins talking, and like 10 seconds after, I could just, they just came underneath me, I was, I was about to shit my pants, <laughs> seriously, I was so scared. <laughs> Today I do a morning jog now. Um, get some rest. I have Bob Babbitt interview, the mandatory, and um, then a bike ride and an off bike run. What time are you riding? Uh, I think around three, uh, around that. Um, have you tried? Have you found that you had, uh, you, like being here, your nutrition's changed or anything? Or um, it's definitely harder to find. I, I feel that. All the time in the states, it's a bit harder to find the same kind of. Uh, I wouldn't say necessarily quality. Uh, here, the quality is very good, but I don't know if they spray it with something else or it just doesn't really feel like the normal. Uh, Takes work. Yeah, it does. What would you have for breakfast? Do you like a porridge guy? Or? Yeah. So uh, this morning it was a porridge, um, some coffee, and um, some nice papaya. Uh, you also have to enjoy it sometimes when you're places like this that you can just have fresh papaya. Um, and then, uh, yeah, some juice. That's that's kind of the normal the normal stuff. Um, I found the first week here, my biggest concern was uh, the prices in the supermarkets. So the first couple of days I took, like, I took the decision of no way in hell I'm gonna pay that much and uh, Maybe it shows some foods that there was not, the quality was not that high. 
Uh, but then I found out they had a Costco just up here, and so I got a membership to Costco, and that's like normal prices. Oh, okay. Like, yeah. Let's go there then. <laughs> They're picking sides, they're crossing the line I stick to the truth, I'm one of a kind Gave it a God and follow his signs Now all of a sudden I'm stuck in my prime I'm wishing them well, I threw them a dime They stuck in the show So what's up now is a one hour or 75 minutes morning jog Just easy, get some drills done um, Enjoy the morning sun a bit Hopefully uh, socialize with some other athletes out there That would be nice um, Yeah, and then afterwards, a couple of interviews, and then home on the couch for uh, for an hour or two, get something to eat, maybe an acai bowl, that would be nice. Um, so basically, it's just enjoying life. Maybe a little more clever, but my faith on display like a header. When I'm stopping, the answer is never. They picking sides, they crossing the line. I stick to the truth, I'm one of a kind. Gave it a God and follow His signs. Now all of a sudden, I'm stuck in my prime. I'm wishing them well, I threw them a dime. They stuck in the shell, they drowning with time. You see the game, we still undefined If they coming at us, they better rewind I feel like LaMelo, I'm young in the league But I'ma still put up the numbers We just hit a million, that's crazy to me God told me I gotta stay humble I stay in Miami, a hundred degrees We treat every day like the summer Yeah, I know Jesus died for my sins Ain't no way that I'ma fumble They saying I changed, but I don't deny it It's part of the plan, yeah God gave me a hand without him I'm nothing, don't need to pretend, yeah You can feel it in the legs Not being used to running concrete Or asphalt all the time it's Takes its toll. I look forward to see the women's race. I think um, it'll, my predictions. Uh, I know uh, James cannot say anything, but um, my predictions would be that we have uh, a Red Bull athletes winning, uh, athlete w re winning, also Red Bull second. Um, one of them from from uh, Swiss and one of them from um, from Great Britain. Um, one of them will swim away from the rest, one of them will probably bike 10 minutes away from, from the whole group and then uh, on the, the run will be kind of the decider. Uh, it's Albert. You, you heard it here first, I'm pretty sure uh, Daniela, she will absolutely destroy the field. So having a look around, you know, you've, you've probably seen quite a few of the, uh, your, your uh, competitors around. Mm -hmm. Who's looking strong out there apart from... Uh, Apart from yourself, who's, who's the one to watch? I think um, good, obviously Gustav Christian and, and Lionel are the main favourites going in, I think. Um, one thing is from how good, uh, Christian and Lionel raced in St. George earlier this year, but also uh, Gustav, was, of course, on a, on, a, on a race like this, he I would expect him to do pretty well, uh, also because he's just a clever guy when it comes to racing. Um, wants to, to watch uh, me, Magnus, um, Curry, uh, there's a lot of guys, Florian Angert. I think that's the cool thing, of course we have the three clear favorites for the race, but uh, other than that, we also have a bunch of guys who can make it to the podium. So it's not it's not like the whole podium in top five is already set. Um, I think we actually have like 10, 15 athletes here who can who can do well. We saw it in Dallas with Colin coming in from kind of nowhere and just doing well. And I, th I feel like we can have a race here where that can happen because uh, we, we have experience here. Um, which is very important, but as well we have some, some new faces where who can do, uh, who can do, who can do a, a good job? So I think it's it's more difficult to predict anything from the men's race. It depends a lot on like it takes a, a very strong performance overall to uh, to win the, the men's race. Where actually both the the swim will, swim will probably be crucial crucial this year. Uh, where before it's it's been kind of a yeah, why should we even do this one? Um, so I think it's yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be a nice one. Nice. Um, the other day I ran in the energy lab and I met like 10, 15 other pros, um, and it's very different how people kind of engage if they 
some of them are not even looking and saying hi and some of them are coming over to get a hug and whatever so it's it's very different how people act in just in race week or, or approaching to race week um, so of course there will also be different ways to kind of cheat or coach uh, different athletes um, but it, it's also a way to get you get to know your opponents because um, of course there is the mental game behind it um, that's You've seen before here on the island how how certain athletes have won world championships not by being the best athlete uh, physically but mentally just being one step ahead and uh, I, th I think that's pretty exciting to see as well. I also know I have, have good and bad days and if it's a bad day I'll probably not look, not look people in the eye um, but if it's if it's not particularly a bad day then of course I would engage in like it's the same people you see all over, uh, like over and over again at races. So, I I wish to, you know, just have kind of a friendly environment. Um, I I think I think, and I also probably know that I've come across as pretty private and pretty um, like not really engaging that much. Uh, but that actually just that was just a part of like missing self confidence and self belief. Believe that people, I just thought people would not really talk to me. Uh, because I was not good enough, but when you find out, find out that that's not really true, that you know they see you as a human being as as any other person would, then of course I'd I'll talk to people. But then again, we are triathletes, so it's not that we are the most social uh, human human beings in the world. Of course, we like to our our own company as well. So I know that that's also part of why some people just yeah don't really need. To, to speak to other people. Um, so what's the session? Um, just easy, really. Easy spinning and um, yeah, just enjoy uh, enjoy the, the view a little bit. That's a uh, that's primary target for this one. How far are you going? Two and a half hours. So uh, close to uh, I think maybe Kauai High and then uh, just turn around and go back. That's, uh, that's pretty much it.